Hey guys, Mega Man 765 here. Um, well, this this is kind of awkward, I guess. <laughs> uh, three years and still no little the castle. I'm positive you're all wondering what the hell's going on. I've been kind of quiet about it, and uh, I understand if some of you are upset. I've seen the comments. I don't worry, I read every single one of them, and uh. Ever I see a comment that says, Where's the Evil Castle? Is he even working on it? You know, it's, uh, I feel pretty bad for not saying anything about it, but I've been having a lot of trouble coming up with a good way to explain the situation. For those of you watching this, I don't, I think Veil of the Castle doesn't need an introduction. It's a huge animation project I wanted to work on involving Mario and, um, just picking on, like, tropes like, the main one being one of the toads were competent and just going from there. It was going to be like an eight episode comedy pretty much with some short episodes here and there. Um, I kind of went back and forth with it. Like I have the whole show just about written out. I have a bit of it animated, like just a bit of it. Like I'm episode is like the first episode is nowhere near done. I just kind of lost my motivation to keep working on it after a while. Like I'm, I'm recording this at 4 a.m. because this has been on my mind for a long time, and I'm not, <laughs> I'm not gonna sleep well until I finally speak up about it. So I'll just explain what happened, like when we started out. Um, when the Evil Castle started out, we were originally going to put our episodes on Machinima, like they were going to fund it and everything. Like we actually went to the headquarters, we got a tour around. We, I mean, I made a video about it a while ago, and um, yeah, we were. I just I figured you know what we're with Machinima now I'm gonna make this even bigger than I thought, and after a little while they just kind of felt silent on us so yeah we tried to manage we tried to just do our own thing and make our maps try to get models but it was a very s slow process and I don't know I just like somewhere in the middle of all that I just kind of lost most of my drive like I wasn't having fun making the show. Like, in Source Filmmaker, anyway. I mean, I still want to make it. Don't get me wrong, I still want to make They Live in a Castle. Like, in one way or another, but I'm just not sure what to do with it right now. Like, at the same time, on the other hand, um, some of the other projects I've worked on, like Luigi Mail, I've actually have been kind of interested in poking back at those. I made... Luigi Mail is kind of an experiment to see if I could do like a weekly series like episodes and so forth and it was kind of working out but somewhere in the middle like I don't know I guess the of the castle was just in the back of my mind and I wanted to try working on it and I got caught up and stuff and you know then I had to get a job I mean I'm working now so I can't really animate as much as I want to I mean I gotta put time between work spending time with friends and well, occasionally making videos. I haven't made a video in a long time. I mean, the latest one I'm doing is a promo for a con the Too Many Games Con, which I'm going to go to, which, well, I'll talk more about that later. I know this isn't exactly the best news, but until forever notice, They Live in the Castle is just going to kind of fall silent. If I'm going to announce anything about They Live in the Castle, rather than get you guys hyped up over something that may not be finished, if I'm going to make another announcement, I want the next announcement for Layla of the Castle to be Episode 1 is almost done, or it's done. And just leave it at that. If I... Yeah, I am i don't know. Like I said, I have, have had a lot of trouble figuring out how to say this, and I figure I'd just be blunt and just kind of go with it. So that's just how it is. On the other hand, though, I do have some other projects I'm working on. I do have a small Undertale video I'm working on, kind of another experiment to see if it'll work out. I have it written out, I have the voice, I have the models, I can animate it, and I can definitely finish it. It's not too tough to make. Uh, when that'll come out, I'm not sure. It depends on my free time and uh, whenever I get around to it. And uh, Luigi Mail, I might also poke back to. I'll probably make uh, something about that later if I can figure out if I can like schedule times to work on it and all that but yeah that's the current state of the the castle I really just lost a lot of motivation to keep working on it until further notice but I will keep making more animations and I'll still keep putting content on the channel I have a few different ideas I wanted to try out to mix in with the source filmmaker stuff but 
we'll see what happens with that when it comes out. And I'll make more videos on that later on. I guess while I'm on here, I should also mention that I'm going to Too Many Games Con again. It'll be in Oaks, Pennsylvania, and it'll be held on uh, June 24th through the 26th. Uh, yeah, so it's in about a week. I I probably should have made a video about this earlier, but I mean, in case you guys, any of you are going to there like now, or if you have to be in the Pennsylvania area, uh, I just wanted to let you know that I will be there. I should probably get a picture of what I'll be wearing. I'll be wearing this shirt, most likely, throughout the con. So if you see anybody wearing this shirt, it'll probably be me. Um, <laughs> if I can actually manage to, I've kind of been wanting to snag like an M. Bison hat or something to wear in the con. I think that'd make me stick out in case anybody uh, is wants to look for me. Uh, I kind of wanted to go to this con to like, try to meet more people, see if I can get a spark back to work on some kind of big project. I mean, so far the big guests that are going there, actually, let me pull it up right now. Uh, a lot of the big guests, are, guests that are going there are uh, Takahata 101, uh, Angry Video Game Nerds going there, James Rolfe, uh, Gaijin Goomba, uh, the Nostalgia Critic, uh, otherwise known as Doug Walker, um, Pixel Dan, The Completionist, Pro Jared, uh, some call me Johnny's going there, Team Four Star, Vine Sauce, uh, Super Best Friends, uh, yeah, sorry. Super Best Friends Play. Uh, yeah, so basically a lot of uh, pretty big people are going to go to this con. So I figured it would be pretty cool to meet some folks that are all in my network or are some is affiliated in one way or another. <laughs> if you want to grab any tickets, uh, the link's down below. Or you can get them at the door if you, again, happen to be around the area. I just wanted to throw that out there and uh, get the word out about the convention. I figure while I'm giving an update and all that. Honestly, from the last year I went, it's it's a hell of a time. The, it's, the tickets aren't too expensive. They have tournaments. They have freaking, uh, of course, games. Maybe too many games. <laughs> uh, if you go to that con, be ready for puns like that. They will be everywhere. But yeah, that's the situation right now. I kind of just wanted to make this real quickly to go off and say what's going on with me um sorry the videos have been really slow i've been going between like working in walmart yeah walmart and uh you know playing with friends uh <laughs> i've actually gotten to final fantasy 14 so maybe that might have a lot to do with it <laughs> uh i might make videos of that later too uh, I do have a free, we have a free company and all that, so maybe I can get some of you guys in there if you happen to be in the Fairy server. Uh, I'll make go more into that soon. Anyways, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I really appreciate those of you who have been sticking around for all these years. I mean, not every YouTuber can say that they've been on YouTube for like eight or seven years. Like, holy crap, like. I'm seeing like all these different YouTubers get like r really huge and just making their channels absolutely gigantic but they haven't been around nearly as long as me like I don't know it's it's a weird feeling to like kind of be like one of the YouTube veterans and just be, having seen it grow all this like well I'm rambling right now <laughs> I should probably just wrap the video up I'm getting really tired if you could tell but yeah if you have any questions that I might have left out in the video and I'm sure I've left out plenty uh, just put it in the comments below. Ask me anything. I will respond to any all of them. I'll go through the comments. I'll try to respond to every single question you uh, send to me. Uh, whether it be silly or actual serious question. Uh, it's the least I can do for you le leaving you all in the dark for this long. Anyways, um, I'm going to go to bed. Uh, thank you for sticking around. I'll see ya.